Unbelievable. Hey, in honor of Zayn's last day with us on the mix, it was only appropriate to bring back our OG, the original morning mixologist, Deb Barshavsky from Deb's Dug's, uh, Deb hey Does Drinks, to send our friend out in a great way. And Deb's back with us. Hey. I'm back. I'm here. I'm here. Good, good, to, see good to see you all. It's yeah. nice to be back here. It's nice great. to see yeah. you. Nice to see you guys. I've asked whenever you're coming back a long time ago, and I'm, I'm, I'm glad it's happened. It's been a minute. It has been. Uh, you've been traveling. I have been. Yeah. Yes. Like like yes. globally. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. I did. I hit my 50th country. That was great. Oh my Lord. Yeah. Not oh. that I'm trying to knock them out, but I did. That was a big landmark for me. Greenland was my 50th country. Wow. So that was 50th. awesome. Wow. And I think one time when we were doing so, that's I was there. And then last time I think I was in Spain. And let us not forget the exotic land of Ohio. Oh my! Where I yes. often well, find myself. Yes. 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 I did mention the Ohio. exotic. Yes, that's right. The is, that, is that where this beautiful drink is coming from? Of Ohio. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> this drink has Japanese roots. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, if I had to guess, I'm going to say it's something sweet. It is something sweet. And so you said earlier in the program, you talked about bittersweet. I'm bringing the bitter. I prefer an Aperol spritz, which is a very <laughs> okay. bitter drink, but I know you prefer sweet. And so when I thought about today's cocktail, I wanted to make sure it was something that was going to reflect what's going on with you. So first of all, it is sweet. And secondly, it uses this bright green liqueur. This is a melon-based liqueur developed by Suntory, who also does the beautiful uh, whiskeys. So, um, but this is Midori, but we're not going to do the... 80s relic. We're going to kind of like bring it forward a little bit so it's not sickly sweet. But um, but the reason why I picked Midori in a Midori based drink is because it's, because it's green. And for me, green is a symbol of growth and renewal. Mm. And I think that is where you find yourself at yes. this point. So I wanted to make a little something that um, reflected where you are on your journey. She thought more about this drink than we think about a show. Come on, oh y'all. There's a lot of depth <laughs> on my <laughs> <That's right>. <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew you were coming, but. Yes, yeah, the meaning nice. behind the drink means a lot. Okay, good, 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 good. So, and this is super, super simple. We're using Midori. As I said, this was developed, Midori, you know, dates back to the 1960s, but it really took off in the 80s, and anybody who was in a fern bar in the 80s will remember the Midori sour, but um, it is super sweet because it's usually used with a um, pre-made sour mix that really isn't as sour as you would want it to be, and um, topped with a lemon-lime soda, which brings additional sweetness to right. it. So I tried to level that out by um, simply using real lemon juice, real lime juice, and okay. and the Midori. So we're just going right. to free pour here, and so you're going to you know, just pour a little My bit. My favorite kind of bar. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> the a free pour. Dabble, yep, yep, exactly. Yeah. So we're going to put a little of it, and look at this color. Is this not amazing? It's, it's like, yeah, neon. So, so we're going to put a little of that in the bottom of each glass. Okay. And of what I got in here, if you guys want to help me pour a little bit. That is our lemon juice. This is our lime juice. Lime. Just a I do free pour. I do a I dash. Do just a little bit. We're looking for like a half an ounce. Oh. Perfect. Yep. Okay. Yep. And I'm going to do all four glasses too. <laughs> We're just going to trade. Trade spots real quick. Boom. Okay. I, I didn't know. I love the colors. This is like so right. Cool. Trade spots again. This is hands on, right? And then what you can do, you can top it with either a plain club soda right. or a flavored club soda. I've got a lemon, a, a, a lemon flavored bubbly water, and also a lime flavored. So it doesn't really matter. It's just like you know what you like. We're just going to top those off. Thank you for the assistance. Perfect. Go all the way to the top because yeah. you want to want to cut okay. this sweetness, and then. You know, I'm bringing it forward by making it not so sweet, but what we're going to stick with is the old-fashioned, really bright red. Maraschino cherry. Yeah, that's what we're going with. We don't, we don't want an advanced no. cherry. Yes. We don't need like a, one of the really mm. fancy cherries. We're going to just use yeah. the old-school cherry because this is all about the color. I mean, Look at that. So this spoon is supposed to actually be an olive spoon, but... Well, who's, who's, well who's, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. we spared no expense yeah, with the budget here on really this show. So. Play well here. Thank you. We're going to do that, and then what you want to do is just give each of these like a little bit of a stir to get that, get that bubbles all throughout the drink. Oh, sure. It's a little bit, and this is this is um, it's a good summer spritz. You know what I mean? It's going right. to be sweet. Let me know if it's sweet enough. Okay. Should we it's, go ahead? Ooh. I say yes. salut, everybody. Yes. Cheers. Yes. Salut. All right. That is going to be sweet. All right. Oh. Deb, it means a lot Cheers. that you're here. You're I'm, so, I'm, I'm you're so, so sweet. happy Thank to be so here. Really happy to be here oh, with y'all. Yes. Really. Yeah. Congratulations. Yes. Like last time. Yep. Yeah. Here's to growth and renewal. Cheers. 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 Yes. Yep. For all again. of us. Yep. Mm -hmm. And those at home. <laughs> and here's those the spelling on my shirt. <clears throat> okay. Uh, that's quite oh. tasty. Mm. You see, a little summer spritz. Mm. That's good. Summer is officially so arrived here. So you like it? You can tell me if you don't. 
You oh, like no, it. I'm, I'm always going to be honest. No, this okay. is really good. All right, because I'm going to leave this whole bottle of Midori here for you for, like, oh. summer drinks. Oh. Okay? It's going with you. Yeah, it is. And then I brought you a couple <laughs> yeah. little, I brought you a couple oh, little um, great. citrus hand towels, little, oh, like, citrus so sweet. hand Thank towels. You, and awesome. then I've also got you a little stack of Deb Does Drinks coasters. Cool. So I just wanted to bring you a few oh, little things to you. remember me by while no, you're doing the evening course. news. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm still going to see you. Thank you so much. No, this is really good. I might have to start my little business on this. I too, you just supply me with everything. <laughs> <laughs> and now you still do, even with the globe trotting, you still go online and you still show uh, how to make drinks. I do. Right? I've been on a little bit of a hiatus okay. because I have been gone a lot, but I was posting um, drinks of the countries that I've been to. Okay. So I was doing all of the local drinks for the countries we visited. So while I didn't have recipes, I was trying to illuminate all of the good things that you can find around the world. Deb does drinks. You Check do it that all. out online. Yeah. Thanks so much. Again. Deb does Thank it all. Very much. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers, Cheers to everyone at yeah. home. Cheers. Too. Yeah. Good, yeah. I know. <laughs> Coming up, it's time to introduce our